There are now companies launching test flights of commercial spacecraft, <laughs> aiming to provide suborbital space flights to space tourists. <clears throat> if you had the opportunity, no. do you want to fly to space? No. No. Why not? It's too scary. Looks cool in movies, but that shit lucky looks scary. Bro, I, I fuck with planes. At first, like, when I got on a plane, like, my very first time, it was, like, scary. Like, but it wasn't. It was, like, fun. It was just, but now it's, like, it's, like, going down the street in a car now or just getting in a car. You know what I'm saying? But it's, like, you having to sit just flat on your back and going straight up fast as shit. Like, and then it's, like, bro, like, what if it blow up or some weird shit, like? You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit kind of just too risky. You go out there, out of space, you can't get back. I don't know. I just be thinking about hella random shit like that. Like, so it's like, trust me, I want to go out of space. It seemed cool, though, but it's just, it's a lot. I ain't gonna lie, it's a lot. You gotta wear fucking body suits and shit, and, nigga. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But for everybody else that's doing it, all the astronauts and shit, though, they turn, they get to see shit that we don't see, which is cool, but... I'm not doing that. What is your opinion on UFOs? I believe them. I seen one. You have? I swear to God. Can you take us back to that moment? When, yeah, where? I remember, yeah, 2019, 2019. I be telling bitches this, like, because they get to, like, like, they be telling everything and have, like, people over and shit. Like, I just, like, kick back or whatever. And I'm saying, like, somebody mentioned something about alien or UFO or some shit. And I sit there. I get to like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like, yeah, I believe in this and that. Blah, blah, blah. Like, I always believed like there was aliens, but I just never really got no proof. I haven't seen an alien, but I for sure seen a UF photo. Motherfucking, we was coming from Miami, going to um, Vegas for what is like the night and day, day and night fest or some shit like that. Trip had to perform. And we were on a jet and everything. Like, when we like, we like 40 minutes from landing, but everyone sleep on a plane. I'm not gonna lie, I was drunk and shit. I'm up there, drunk and everything, chilling, just waiting for time to go by, I'm just kicking it. But everybody's sleeping and everything. And so I'm just looking out the window, and like, we like 30,000 feet in the air. I look at the little, the little GPS map shit, and I'm saying, I show you like everything. I'm looking there, and it's say we 30,000 feet in the air, and I just keep looking at it just to see how much the time is we got to we land and everything. And so, but I'm looking out the window, and then I just see like a black figure like in the sky, like kind of far, like but just close enough to where you can see it. I'm thinking it's another plane or some shit, like. And so we flying and we moving and shit. And I just noticed that it's not moving, it's just right there. You know what I'm saying? And so I'm just looking like, just trying to think, like, what the fuck? Like, that shit just sitting right there, like we still moving. I'm up here just right there, like. And so I just try to wake the homies up, like, yo, like, wake up, like, come see what this is, this and that. Them niggas was not getting up at all, not wake up, none of that shit. So I go back to the window and look out the window. I see it still right there. So I'm like, bro, I'm tripping, bro. I go grab my phone, right? As soon as I click on my phone, I unlock it. I click on the camera. I look up, that bitch right there, and I go to the video. As soon as I go to take a video and press record, that bitch was gone. And it, I didn't really think about it until after that. Like, I was just looking like, Bro, what the fuck? I don't know, I was just sitting there just kind of surprised. And so then when we landed and everything, like it just all made sense because like Area 51 is like out there in that way. Like, and we was just flying over but nothing but desert for like the past like hour or so or however long, you know what I'm saying. Like, and so, but I didn't really think about it until after the show. As soon as we got off the plane, niggas got busy and everything and started moving around. Have to go up there to the spot. And, but then after, I was still thinking about it though, like, and I'm just like, bro, what the fuck was that like? And it just all made sense. I'm like, bro, that was a UFO I seen. Like, I know it is, like, that shit. It was fried. But when I tell that shit to people, but they look at me and everything, I be like, bro, hey, I mean, I can't make you believe me. That's why I be thinking, like, when they got the little, the little um, TV shows and shit on UFO and everything, they got the people recreating, acting it out and everything. Like, if a show be... Obviously, it's, they, they're going over it, and I'm saying, like, doing a little shit, everything. But it's like, now I'm starting to think, like, because it's like, I'll be feeling like this shit is, like, fake and real, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but it's like, now it's like, I feel like it's 100% real, like, they don't be going on that show lying type shit, like, because if they was a nigga shit, I can be on that bitch and tell my story, and people be like, he's lying. But it's like, I believe him now. The show, I believe. I believe in aliens, I always did, but now that was just, like, the real proof to stamp it, like, you know what I'm saying? 
Now, when this took place, were you nervous at all? <laughs> I was drunk as fuck. I was confused. Like I said, it didn't really click in my head. Like, I didn't think, like, UFO. I'm just thinking, like, what the fuck is that right there? Like, like why is it not moving? You know what I'm saying? Like, just, and we 30,000 feet in the air. It was just hovering right there, just levitating, not moving. Just, you know what I'm saying? Like, 30,000 feet in the air. Now, was this a private jet you were in? Mm-hmm. Did you happen to ask the pilots when you uh, landed to see if they saw it? No, nah, it was just too much going on. I ain't gonna lie. As soon as we got off the plane, like, niggas was just, as soon as we landed, niggas was just geek ready to get off the fucking plane, so. Mm -hmm. But no, I didn't even think to ask them for real. Like, I told the homies, though, I told them and everything, but they don't believe me. They don't believe me. What about, what did Trip think? He don't believe me. I don't, think, I don't think he believe me. But it's cool though. I mean, she likes, I know what I see now. Yeah, but. And for time reference, it's July 2021 now.